My name is Sarah Reed. I'm from Houston, Texas. And I'm here because everything I love, everyone I love is being threatened by this pipeline. Um, my family in Houston will be forced to breathe toxic air from tar sands refineries. My friends all along the pipeline route uh, will have their groundwater poisoned. Their farmland will be infertile. Um, and all my friends globally um, will have to deal with the consequences of climate change that will be unleashed by the tar sands oil. I'm, I'm out here because TransCanada has so little regard for my life, for the life of my 11-year-old brother who hasn't had the chance to really live at all yet and I want him to grow up in a world with clean air, clean water, uh, without runaway climate change and yeah that's why I'm here to blockade. My name is Shannon Beebe and I'm from Lake Dallas, Texas and this is so important to me because if no one is going to step in, they're just going to continue to lay down the pipelines and just start pumping the tar sands as quick as possible. We need to take direct action. Direct action is the only thing that is going to get to make a change. I'm Gary Stewart. I'm a native Texan and currently living in Dallas, Texas. I'm here because after eight years of working on environmental issues, it has become abundantly clear that the traditional cha uh, channels for change are not working. Uh, the system is rigged, and the, the agencies that are supposed to be protecting us are not protecting us. In other words, they've just become rubber stamps for big oil, big gas, big coal, and other polluting industries to do whatever they want with impunity. When our president gave his approval for the Keystone Pipeline, I said, that's it. Direct action has to be done. This is wrong. I will not accept it. I'm willing to go to jail to say no and to stop this outrage against the citizens of the state, the property owners of this state, and the very land itself. So I hope that this message will encourage all of you out there to realize you do have a stake in this and you do have a voice and you do have the power to change the world in the way that you want it to be.